points. The expected huge crowd was at Football Park to see the Crows do a job on Hawthorne, and right from the start, that's what they saw. Tony McGuinness kicked Adelaide's first goal in the AFL, but that was only one of six in the opening term, with the Hawks' back line working overtime. Andrew Jarman was having the best of his duel against brother Darren, while the oldest player on the ground, David Marshall, was showing the opposition how to do it. David Marshall, a standing start. Hudson was trying to lift Hawthorne's fortunes, but when McGuinness bagged his second, Adelaide led by 51 points at half-time. As hard as the Hawks attempted to get back in the game, the Crows were simply too good. A high floater. There's two of them there. Smith. If it was possible, things got worse for the visitors. New recruit Matthew Robram forced from the ground with an ankle injury. Then Brereton and Paul Deere were reported. Brereton for charging and Deere for striking Crows captain Chris McDermott. Their charges to be heard tomorrow morning. While all that was happening, Adelaide continued to surge forward. Goals to Lidner, Jarman and Klug had extended the lead to more than 70 points. In the end, it was Adelaide home by 86 and a performance that will go down as one of the best ever against the all-conquering Hawthorne. Start of the season, a chance for Del.